Middlesex survived a tiny scare before completing their sixth win in this season's LV County Championship to move within five points of second division leaders Northamptonshire and with a game in hand. Their latest win came over Derbyshire by seven wickets at Lords. Having dismissed the visitors with the final ball of the previous evening, Middlesex had all day to knock off 91 runs to win, although Derbyshire did show some fight as Tony Palladino had Sam Robson held in the gully by Wayne Madsen with his third delivery. Chasing such a small target, Middlesex came out with positive intent to try to get the job done as soon as possible. The weather was certainly not going to save Derbyshire, who needed a miracle to turn this game around, even more so when both Scott Newman and Chris Rogers played exemplary drives to the cover boundary. Newman was out without playing a shot for the second time in the match, this time after making nine, the delivery from Palladino just grazing the pad for an LBW decision. David Milan hit a career-best 143 in the first innings, but this time he lasted only 15 balls before he nicked Tim Grunewald behind to go for one, with his side now on 25 for three. Any tension they may have been feeling was then eased by their captain, Neil Dexter, who came in and played a couple of fine shots off Palladino, who'd managed to get the ball to swing. Still, that's not much use if you crack to the fence like this. There was an inevitability that Rogers would be there to guide his side home against the county he skippered for a while until he left at the end of last summer for Lords. The way he batted and the way he timed the ball so effortlessly, you would have thought that he could have chased down 300, but thanks to his side's bowlers, he didn't need to do that. With each one of his excellent shots to the boundary, Derbyshire knew that this was not going to be a day for miracles after all. Even though this was only a cameo, it was a masterclass in batting against a side which could have done with something similar from their top order in this match. In both innings, they got their team off to a terrible start. The winning shot came with another superb sweep which gave Rogers his 7th 4 to finish on 46 from just 55 balls. After an hour and a half it was all over and the ultra cool Rogers was able to express some emotion. It was a huge win for Middlesex, their second successive victory after they beat Surrey last week. They earned 23 points from this game to close the gap at the top of the second division table to just 5 points. They now appear to be favourites for promotion. Derbyshire, meanwhile, managed only four points, which means that they are now in sixth place, 37 points adrift of the promotion places.